ให้มิ่งลวกวิดเนี่ยลวกวิดเนาะมั่งอันนาบุญเมียนมั่งวิดโอดักคลีนโอดักวิดสไลซ์จินเจอร์ก็สปูนเอฟชิคเก้นซอสพุดคอร์วอเตอร์อินคือบอยลิงวอเตอร์ว่าทำไมฉันพุดบอยลิงวอเตอร์เพราะมันจะช่วยให้ร่างกายเปลี่ยนสีจากเดิมไปเป็นสีแดงแล้วฉันจะทำให้เนื้อหมูไม่ออกไปจนเป็นสีแดง Duck, umami, and yummy. So I add enough water to cover the duck and boil it. At the meantime, I have some bamboo shoot here. The baby bamboo shoot, young tips bamboo shoot. I will slice it. And then we should need to boil for a few times. As usual, slice it. Put in cold water, bring it to boil, rinse it. Do that again, boil again, four times. Get rid of the toxins in the bamboo. When the duck, um, when the duck came to boil, um, I skim the. I do what I do best. I skim the impurity off. If you want your broth clear, skim the scum out. If you don't bother, it's fine. Because uh, the scum, the impurity is just uh, iron from the blood, from the bone. Only. Ugly. Make your uh, broth. Make your broth cloudy. It tastes better when it um, clear. Okay. I put a kettle of water on. When the duck started to uh, boil, you start timing, yeah? So you need to know how long it's been boiling for. Lower the heat and keep simmering it. Make sure it's keep on boiling. Skim the impurity out and the duck needs to be boiled in the water for at least 30 minutes. the water so you need to drain it after boiling it for a little bit like two minutes boiling drain it and keep repeating the step for three to four times then you get your bamboo suit need to bring to boil first and then you need 
it to be boiling for two minutes. It takes around five minutes um, to skim off this uh, scum. Uh, this one doesn't have much of the impurity, so it's only five minutes. Now I need um, two brown onion. I add to the broth. Roughly chops. I put the heat up a little bit because the uh, onion is cold so we'll slow down the boiling so I need to make sure it's go back up to boil straight away while I wait this one Bamboo suit. I will drain the bamboo suit. What I do, I keep the hot water, the boiling water of the bamboo suit to kill weeds in the garden. Eco-friendly weed killing. So this boiling water will halfly cook. So because it's halfly cooked, the wheat, the wheat won't be able to grow again. It'll be dead forever, never come back. So I don't have to buy the wheat sprayer, no chemicals, eco-friendly, it's safe for the garden. So I kill my weeds. Few pots of the water. I don't even waste it down the drain. Now I add the steam chicken bone. You know the the chicken drumstick that I steamed. For the meat, revolve the meat to put in the stir fry noodle for lunch. Now I use the bone to put in the stock to make my stock richer. And then we will boil again or I'll cover it. For the rest of the time, and I started timing. And it started boiling. Calm for 30 minutes until I get the duck out. Cover and lower the heat. Make sure it's still um, simmering. Not um, overflow. After 30 minutes of boiling, I need to get my duck out. Now 
love with the broth. I will add my bamboo soup in. Put seasoning in. Spring onion, voila! That's it! Nice and easy! Come back up to boil straight away. Off the stove. And see ya! When my broth tastes a little bland, what do I do? I add sauce bring it to boil and top the noodle with the bamboo soot You can have any kind of noodle that you like. Uh, chopped coriander, fresh is better. I keep saying that, but I have frozen only. So. Spring onion. Pour the boiling broth on top. If you want the fat bit, get the fat bit. If you don't want the fat of the duck, just get your broth from the middle of the pot. Now, some people would like to have their duck pieces on top and then pour the boiling broth on top. But to, by doing that, of course, the duck um, will lose the juice out to the broth. So, instead of putting on top of the soup, I'm gonna dip it later. Now you can eat it with duck piece. Ta-da!